Mic test, mic test. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Buddy Bison stream. I hope we're all having a wonderful day today because I most certainly am. So today we are back with some more uh, Tales of Zestiria, which I'm excited to play some more of because it has been since uh, last Saturday that it's, uh, that it's uh, you know, been played. So last time we were... Go out to the mountain to try and find an earth element um, seraphim to uh, raise the riverbed to let the bridge be built because we can't just help deliver medicine because then other people will come after uh, sorry Jesus and be like yo help us too and for whatever reason that's a bad thing um, so we were like hey we need to like at least 
you know, give them a, fo- a stepping stool to work off of. And they're like, okay, fine, we can do that. So we came up to the mountains to find an Earth Seraphim, and we found Edna. And Edna is the little sister of Aizen, who apparently was turned into a dragon. So that's cool, and she wants to turn her older brother back into not a dragon. Um, but yeah, so that is the deal. So now we have three Seraphim and only one human character, which is fantastic. Um, so she seems to be very art attack focused for the most part. Next, our Stormy Rain. Um, yeah, let's... Um... I don't know how to. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's that. That was the issue. Um, okay, and uh, yeah, so that's just uh, what we're doing in the off time. I have not played the game at all. I did look up a couple things though. So one thing that I was getting confused on was this combo hits thing because i was at 59 out of 60 and i have no idea what that was so this is actually reach 60 hits in a single combo not do x number of combo hits it's do this many hits in one combo so my longest combo is 59 hits against one enemy i guess um, and I need that I need that to be 60 for me to get this thing, which it taunts me because basically that means I'm going to need to fight basically bosses <laughs> to be able to get that likely. Um, so, yeah. Um, so then there's battles and higher arts, which I can't really get sooner or later. Uh, quick recoveries. I need six more of those. And I was going to go grind those out, but I decided not to. Um because yeah, I just don't feel like doing it, frankly. Um, and then we have the Banish Blasts and the just any blasts. Um, yeah, and I'm going to need to remember how to... Um, I'm going to need to remember how to uh, play <laughs> because it's been a little bit. I haven't really thought about it. Um, so that's going to be its own fun thing uh now if i do remember right my equipment so i do have yeah various things with the stars and when they get maxed i should be swapping them out uh you're new so you of course don't have anything uh whereas these uh guys are working a bit better now you know i will swap equipment immediately outright because at least oh Oh, interesting. Okay, so it's not... Okay, that changes things. So it's maxing proficiency with an item maxes it... Like, the item is maxed. It's not the character's proficiency with the item. It is the item's proficiency in general. Okay. Okay, that's important. So I can't just... So I actually need multiples of items to do it. Right, because this firing plus one was max proficiency by someone, not necessarily Lila. Okay, so that, okay, so they changed that, I think, in Berseria. Because in Berseria, it was like you could taught, you could mix around items across characters. And that was one way to kind of elongate the, uh, the item itself. Um, okay, and you have point of interest deduction, which is good. Edna has money finding and snack preparation. Um, yeah, I will keep money finding on because that's fine. You can have snack preparation and, um, we're not low on health, so it's not a big deal for health maintenance. Um, want to, nope, okay. Uh, nope, square is that circle r2 is that l2 here we go okay so l2 is this map um l1 is okay okay good to know just need to get everything back in my wheelhouse okay let's head on back uh shouldn't take too long because we need to get back to bridgeland um okay quest <laughs> story 
What's going on? Oh, the assassins. You. They called you their boss, didn't they? Indeed they did. I really am the shepherd. I know you won't believe me, but it's true. I pulled the sword out of the stone. For your sake, it doesn't matter a bit. It really should. I can feel someone's blessed domain. What? Oops. Oh god. She has a level of resonance on par with the shepherd. She does? But she can't even see us. Let's save the chat for later. This girl is strong. I can tell. May these weary bones find peaceful rest. Okay, that was that was horrible. Um she Someone's blessed domain. What? Okay, you. You mean she has a level of. How is she so. Oh, because I'm on moderate. Okay. I'm gonna have to swap this down. Let's save the chat for later. This girl is strong. I can tell. This is pretty tough. Let's now. Uh, nope. Okay, we're gonna retry one more time, but because now I know that the uh I can feel someone's blessed domain. What? Let's just get out of yeah, let's just run. Huh? She's not gonna come after us? Yeah. <laughs> this is the first time where I've had multiple... Uh, where I've had a... This is the first time I feel like I've in, encountered a game like this. Hasn't been properly where the... Um, That's why it's causing her to have a negative reaction. Oh, does she have a seraphim? That wasn't clear. Oh, hello there, sir. <laughs> Nice hat. Oh my, that's Dezel. Dezel. Do you know of him? For the first time, I feel like I've uh, kind of a game where they expect you to use the flea mechanic. Band of traveling mercenaries. Why is he with the assassins? I suppose something happened to the mercenaries. I suppose. There must be a story behind it. You don't just join up with a bunch of assassins for no reason. But you could. I'm surprised he hasn't become a Hellion by now, hooking up with an Assassin's Guild. There was no malevolence at all coming from that Assassin. No way. Yeah. No malevolence will fester among those who are pure and clean of heart. That Assassin is exactly like you, Saray. Hmm. A pure and clean of heart Assassin? Really? They make those? Apparently. Don't really need to question it. It was so, there. It doesn't matter if I'm real or fake, huh? Then I guess this is what you meant by me taking on the burden of the shepherd. Yep. Don't fool yourself. Humans don't think for a moment about how you feel. But what do you expect? They're humans. They're assholes. She's right, I'm afraid. You'll have to learn to deal with it. Well... Good thing you're pretty tough to begin with. <laughs> I wish. They don't care that I'm the stand-in for King Arthur slash Jesus. All they care about is their goddamn grubby money stuffs. Okay. Yo. Oda, 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 oda. Yo. Are calling me. That, that's cool. Learn new art, test proficiency increase, proficiency increase. Money finding, talent. Money finding, with this talent you'll find money lying around at regular intervals. There's no law that says you have to return it in, so it's yours to keep. There seems to be higher chance of finding money in towns than in fields. Yo, okay. That's... We got some order order going, okay. Yeah, let's let's have that. Please, Edna. Get out. Tiger blade. No mistake. Have some you in the crap out of it. Purify the earth. Yeah. Yeah. No. Uh. Red beacon giant. Run out. Stay fast. Run out of the time that war. Ready? Go. Focus. Let's get him. There we go. 
Amber Garment. Their new battle action. Nice. So, what's that? Uh, Reviver. Uh, one time only when taking fatal damage, automatically release armatization. Okay. That could be good. Okay, Choir Blast, 500. 47 out of 50. Okay, and I'm doing these moderate battles. Yeah, I'm trying to take as many battles as possible on, like, the uh, nothing enemies, just because that'll make it a bit easier for me to do um, the battle. They'll make... I can do those uh, battle actions a bit sooner, a bit easier. Still don't think you can help us out? I'm doing the against nothing enemies. The seraphim at will, isn't that right? Do whatever you want. Yeah, no, you're not a tool for me to use. If you really don't want to help, I'll find some other way. <laughs> Even after the trouble we've gone through. I see. You like to guilt trip a girl into making the first move. <laughs> Dick. Saray, maintain your purity. <laughs> I knew she was messed up, but... Man, if you guys aren't the dullest crew of fuddy-duddies ever assembled, I was going to help you from the get-go anyway. <laughs> Why would I have come with you uh. if not? <laughs> You're welcome. <sighs> Thanks a million. Thanks. <laughs> you, got, you gotta mess with us, don't you? Can't just <laughs> say that you'll help like a normal person. So you can take on a job, maybe a mistake. There's no sign of the shepherd around either. I was kind of looking forward to seeing him, too. Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, it's me, the shepherd. Come on. Come on over. Come on over here. Hey, how's it going, friend? You're no good at all. I won't even know where to go about trying to try to fix it. Yeah, Lord okay. Soray, it is a pleasure to see you again. Hello. Likewise. How are things looking? Well, there's still no telling when the bridge will be repaired. All right. Then I'll make it so that the bridge can be fixed. What exactly does that entail? Uh, forgive me, but I'm a bit confused, Lord Soray. I won't fix the bridge, but I'll make it so it can be fixed. In any case, I shall summon Lady Alicia. Please, wait here a moment. Come on, Alicia, get over here. I need two, I need two humans. So we can have four people in the, in the combat party. Please. Wait a minute. You're going to do this right away? Yeah. I want to cheer them up as soon as possible. I'm a nice guy. But... Don't you know what humans will think about you if you demonstrate power that transcends their simple understanding? Their simple understand. I'm Jesus! I do indeed. Huh. Well, okay. Suit yourself. Maybe you like being treated like a monster. Hmm. It's your call. I won't stop you. But think carefully about who stands to lose the most from what they're warning you about. Right. All you need to do, Saray, get on your knees and pray. And then it makes it... <laughs> Build the foundation of the bridge immediately? No. We're not, we're not gonna build it immediately. <laughs> we're gonna heed their Change advice. Your mind, I take it? Yeah. Better we do it late at night after everyone's gone to bed. Hey, fine by me. Sorry, I know everyone was worried about me. I probably just wasn't thinking. You tend to take too much on by yourself. Yeah, I'll watch out. Yeah. Oh, Saray, you're back. What's up, Alicia? Hey. How's it going? Lord Saray, what exactly is it you intend to do? Well, I, uh... Alicia, we decided it wouldn't be good for Saray to draw too much attention here. We're waiting till midnight. So... <laughs> Help. Well, the sun has already <laughs> set. Why don't we handle this first thing tomorrow? Oh, a fine idea. Very well. I do like the idea of if I did do yes and just sorry, it's just, oh, let me use my messiah power. Incidentally, Nate, regarding the transport of your goods to Marvin. Oh, oh, yes, of course. You're the best, Alicia. Yeah. Now then, let us wait until midnight. 
Or at the very least, until everyone's gone home. But yeah, just like, hey, you could probably get away with it if you just, like, got on your knees and prayed and you didn't make a big deal of you doing something and it just, like, looking like stuff worked because you prayed. <laughs> To the seraphim, like, oh, great seraphim, please bestow upon me blessing. Dude, so cool. <laughs> like, the fists. Oh, yeah, we got anime? Yo! Come on, it's time to order, order the river. <laughs> Oh, interesting. So from the outside, armatization doesn't... Oh, interesting! So armatization is purely for people with the sight. That is... Huh. That's neat. Makes even less sense as to... How, uh... Well, I guess it makes more sense as to why the, uh royal guys or the chancellors were oh all confused God. to be like oh the pow his power Nath. i can scarcely believe what i'm seeing so this is the shepherd's power <laughs> you gotta not tell no one Please bitch tell me. i can explain this means marland is saved oh joyous day thank you Oh, thank you so much. Three cheers for the shepherd. Hip hip hooray. Hip hip hooray. Hip hip hooray. Lord Sohan, there we go. Three. You intend to head out right away, don't you? In order to avoid prying eyes. Yes. So yeah. give me the medicine. We're going to go to Marlin from here. Going to Plague Town. I suspected as much. Then, if you may, please escort Lady Alicia with you as well. Mr. Nath? Lady Alicia. I know your position is a difficult one, but your duty in Marland is all too crucial. Please go at once and demonstrate your famed ability and sincerity. Go be nice and good. So you knew. I may be stuck here for now, but if you two are in Marland, then I will know I can rest easy. Please attend to your duties and leave the bridge to me. Sounds good. Understood. Better be I'm complete sorry, by the time I'm back, you bitch. Thanks. I shall make sure the bridge is even better than before, milady. Milady. So there are those who understand. Yes. <laughs> this is the happiest I've been in a while. Crying, I'll puke. <laughs> Crying, I'll puke. Can I please take some medicine from you? Can I ask such a thing after all you've done? Yeah. Thank you. I am in your debt once more. <laughs> Go I heal the plague. Thanks for all your help, Nath. Oh, poppycock. It is I who should be thanking you. Go be as Jesus and heal the sick. Alicia? Please. Will I really be able to cross the river with you? Well, we just got it's just, it's just you. You've yeah. already made the squire's pact. Yeah. Come on. Mr. Nath. Thank you for being so understanding. We shall meet again. Just gotta jump across some rocks. It's fine. Lord Sore, thank you so much. Bye -bye. Lady Alicia, Bye -bye. I leave matters in Marlin to your capable. Bye bye. Bye bye. Wobble 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 wobble. Wobble 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 wobble. wobble. Oh. <laughs> uh, and they don't they don't let me they don't let you see yourself uh jumping across it. It's just just hey, you're on the other side now. When Alicia met Edna. Oh, incredible. I suppose even a raging river is no trouble for a shepherd. But you should still avoid using your powers in front of other people. Yeah, you're probably right. She is. If earth dwellers are there to freak out every time like this one does. I may slip my leg. <laughs> wow. Sarah Fedna, I deeply regret my transgression. Yeah, you ought to. <laughs> wow. We're already on a first name basis, even though we just met. You're awfully rude, you know that? <laughs> wow. Please forgive me. If you're sorry, then do the Norman Karena as penance. Norman Karena. 
What now? <laughs> it's like that the Macarena. How disrespectful. Please forgive me. <laughs> if you're sorry, then do the Norman Karena as penance. <laughs> don't infinite loop the squire. Like, you understand that Edna is toying with Alicia, don't you? Do something. Sorry. I just thought maybe if they had a chance to talk together, they might, you know, become friends. <laughs> Alicia, this is just how Edna is. You can't take anything she says seriously. Spoken like a true amiibo. What's amiibo? You don't know? <laughs> What's amiibo? Okay, enough. <laughs> Guys, just shut up. <laughs> Please. <laughs> we can't keep we can't keep going around on this. Please just shut up. Be much appreciated. Um, okay, so good. Now we have Alicia over here. So that is nice. Good art, good art, good art, good art, good art. What the fuck is that thing? It's a cat. Um, what arts do you got? You got some cool shit. Pyre light. That seems neat. Um, I don't know what the proficiency stars with the skills means. Um, definitely could force some of it to happen if I just like turned off a lot, a whole bunch of their other skills. But I'm just gonna go off of the idea that they probably know what to do best because they have a lot of skills so i don't want to confuse anything um ooh okay so i have shatterfang heavenly torrent sonic thrust so a with the directions will give the thing good um equipment i think i got a new spear for her yeah i have this amber spear which i can put on afterwards you got yes anthem good Okay, so once this gets up provision, then I'll do that. Amber garment, void ring, you're doing fine. Amber boots, and okay. So we should be fine, all things considered. Um, both of these ways seem to be ways to uh, get there. So I'm going to go the long way around, see what happens. Hopefully get some more fights. Uh, I do have to try and There we go. Give me some blasts. My will shall pierce thee just like this spear. Okay, cool. <laughs> My will shall pierce thee. Yeah, so I need to get some more blasts out so I can get those things done. Good. Amber earrings. Amber earrings. We like that. What's that? Found a new discovery point. Uh, Falkland squirrel. Falkland squirrel. Oh, aren't you just the cutest thing? It's just a squirrel. No, squirrels are cute. The fluffiness of the tail. It must be the Falkland squirrel. A rare sight indeed. Calm down. But look, it's so fluffy, foofy, adora boofy. Don't tell me you're not moved by its precious little face. Adora boofy. Unlike you, I don't feel a need to ooh and coo over cute things to make others think I'm cute as well. W what? No, that that's not at all. Shh. I'll frighten poor Poofy away. You're right. My apologies. <laughs> if you're truly sorry, do the squirrel Karena for me. The fluffy version. There's a squirrel Karena? There's a fluffy version? <laughs> Poor Alicia. She's so easy to toy with. Should we leave them like this? Understood, Miss Edna. Please teach me the squirrel Karena. I wish to master this fluffy version. <laughs> Are you sure? My training is very <laughs> Is there just a Karena for everything? Challenge. I think it's all right. They look like they're having fun. True enough. See, the thing is, Edna will have to do the Squirrel Karena so that Alicia can do it as well. I don't know if that's considered a win or not. There we go. Guy interrupted. Their new battle action. It's beautiful, but it is an umbrella. Okay, good. We got a new battle action. Gimme. Uh, hidden guard. That's like, no, wait, add that one. Blow blast. 
normal. After two combos, press and hold RT to consume one BG, increase the effect of Paramour boost on self and unleash a blowback attack. After two combos, press and hold RT. One combo, press and hold RT to consume one BG, restore 50 SP to partner, save four five attack. Conditions, blast 50 out of 500. And uh, any more. Harmonizations, 1,000. Banish blast, still need to get to 200. Um, five stone banish, speak one minute, okay. I mean, yeah, I mean, if I just need to get blast and banish blast out, air recovery, X in the air, okay. Peeling guard, peeling guard. Still need to do quick evades. Got the chamomile. Focus by two. Excuse me. Once again, just dump all them herbs into into Sori's mouth. That's all that matters. How much herb does he have? How well spiced is his gullet? Earth ring, proficiency increased. Okay, and I need to go through. Okay, that's next. Okay, amber earrings, you go with that. Amber boots. Um, yeah, you take those. You're not maxed on anything. You're not maxed on anything. You're maxed on boots. So, take those boots. You're maxed on those boots. Take those boots, you're not maxed, you're maxed on that. Here, put those on. You don't have anything, okay. Ugh, got so much equipment that we're gonna need to juggle around. But even then, it's not like I'm 100% uh, sure what is best, what isn't. If I don't get that mess in the morning soon, who knows what could happen, you know? The plague could get worse. That's what could happen. It's pretty. It's pretty easy. <laughs> Who knows? Given that it's a relatively obvious one. Come on. Give me receive backpack attachments. Cool. Was hoping for equipment. Good. Nope. Is it over? I'm kind of tired. Easy enough. <laughs> uh, as stated, it's not exactly the uh, hardest thing to do. One, like once you have four people, I feel like it's pretty easy to. Uh... Ready, everyone. I command. Be gone. Ready, destroy it now. Try it out. Why is it not armatizing? Weird. Yeah, no idea why it wasn't, uh... Why it wasn't actually doing lavender. Attack fire by two. Please and thank you. Make me stronger. Okay, and then I saw... This from out about. Feed. Switching Seraphim. The basic goal with Switching Seraphim is to select one that is strong against the target's weaknesses. Take the opportunity to switch out Seraphim when their HP is low or they are surrounded by enemies. The key to bringing down powerful enemies lies in utilizing the full range of attack options available to you. Yes, this was... This is known. Um, okay, but before I do that, I want to come over to this save point and actually save. And check out that door, because I presume I'm going to be going that way after... I finish whatever I need to in Marland. Um, okay, so... Good. Hello, gods. How do you do? Princess Alicia, welcome to Marland. However, I'm very sorry, we can mind entering from the north side and instead the side closed off at night for the citizen safely. Oh, okay, so there's two entrances to town. Makes sense. 
I was expecting that to be like a gate to the next area, but I guess a I guess a second door to the town is equivalent. Music's good. Amber ribbon tie. Batman. Nope. Amber ribbon tie. Jesus Christ. Let's do some fortune telling. Please pick one. Okay. Oh, unique. Oh, this one's blank. That means your spirit is pure and clean, like this paper. Oh, thank you. <laughs> She's gullible. Way too gullible. <laughs> he's just he is <laughs> sitting there like what the heck <laughs> cannot believe that alicia is this gullible <laughs> there we go Now I'm just trying to make sure I didn't miss anything. Rubenna, defense by two. That'll actually be useful because I take many a hit. Um, I could imagine you being potentially annoying. Please, so. Equipment proficiency, and then we're gonna go over here. I can sure sense the ancient this. Jump. We're near one. Quick step. Use the quick step four allows you evade an enemy's non art projectile attacks. Like the others, this counts as a quick evade. It's risky, but desperate times call for desperate measures. Hey, Fontano. Hey, nerd. No audio. Okay. Uh, incidentally, unblockable enemy attacks in the game <laughs> can be quick evaded with any type of quick step. However, quick evade will not trigger for knockback attacks. Okay. So, there are certain ones that you have to quick step. Interesting. Um, I'm pretty close to, I think, getting the, uh, whatchamacallit one, the 20. So I need one more. Those, those guys spinning were really nice to me. In terms of, uh, being able to, in terms of being able to get the, uh, stuff. There we go. Dude, it's so cool. It's so good. Okay, he said... Point of interest nearby. At least it said something like that. Didn't it? Could have sworn it did. But I don't know why. Receive apple gel. You cannot carry anymore. Put it back. <laughs> okay, but yeah, that's... See, this is the first time... <laughs> what a nerd, sorry. I mean, yes, indeed. Sorry, sorry is, in fact, a nerd. And he's proud of it, too. Um, okay, maybe if I walk around... Oh, you. You seem... Found a new discovery point. Roadside Guardian. The Roadside Tron. Is this a shrine to Seraphim? Yes. It used to be a vessel of some sort. Used to be, huh? Long ago, there were many minor shrines like these for spreading the blessings of the Seraphim. Indeed. It used to be there were throngs of people offering prayers. The numbers might have dropped some, but there's definitely still people who pray to the Seraphim. Oh, yeah, like, remember the shrine at Edna's Mountain? Someone left flowers there, right? That was me. Oh. Huh? <laughs> that shrine is a stand-in for a grave. A grave for all the humans my brothers killed. Oh. Oh. I didn't know. I don't need any sympathy. It's the humans' own fault anyway. 
If you hear about a dragon, you wander over to check it out, you get gobbled up. Simple as that. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on. Horus. What's going on, Horus? Level 26. Okay. Need to go in just to see, but yeah, that that is about what I was expecting. Uh, okay, support talents, Lila, health maintenance. Let's put that on. Snack remedy. Yeah, because I don't think I really need to swap them around. I'd rather focus on one person Snacks getting so enough. Good, especially after a battle. Like, to me, that's a bit more important. Like, hey, get get enough of, uh, like, get one person's sub skill very high. That way, they're really good at it, and it happens a lot more frequently versus trying to balance multiple. Okay, yep, this is definitely a uh, malevolence-filled uh, plague town. Is this because of the epidemic? Oh, it's a dog. Uh, I take it that you're not good around dogs. Not particularly. Maybe I was just worried about claws and effect. <laughs> claws and effect. What? Oh, dog turned. Time to beat the shit out of this pup. So we can get to sixty. <laughs> oh well. You sure are strange, Soraya. Why aren't titled Curious Cat? Definitely weird. You're also really not weird. I'm not weird. <laughs> McLeo isn't weird. <laughs> get out of here. Life here in town. Of course. Look how full of malevolence this place is. <laughs> we just killed that dog. <laughs> to the rest of the world, we just killed a dog. And that just now was a dog hellion, wasn't it? Right. That was a hellhound. The pathogen itself has assumed hellion form. No. Oh. Hmm. The plague itself? Time to kill the plague. Let's hurry to the sanctuary and deliver the medicine. Let's kill the plague. Um, okay. And I just got a... Um, I just got a thing. By the... Got Curious Cast. Stun, re stun time reduced by 20%. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. And I definitely need to get new weapons. Um, and all that fun stuff. Give me the anthem tie. Yeah, your spear is almost there, but you at least have another amber spear to work with. Void ring is up. Let's give you fire. Okay, your tiara is up. Don't really have anything for you. Your void ring is up. Here is an earth. Good. Yeah, God, we are going to... Like, I guess the benefit of having the system where you, like, the proficiency is just on the item itself versus 
uh, uh, character specific is that you are going to be able to get more items max leveled faster so that you're going to be able to fuse them a little bit easier but um, but figuring out exactly what you're going to need to be doing necessarily is a bit more annoying now you look around and see healthy folks doing just fine, but then there's people sicker than sick. What's causing this? But And the sicker than sick people are hanging around the healthy people? Like, not very good plague management, gonna be real. Sure is a lot of gold lying around out there. Money finding 10 gold. Yeah, I need to see how much gold it actually, like, gives. If it's a significant amount, or if it's not, then I'm just gonna swap it over to, uh... I just saw a snack. A written in ancient tongue. Oh, really? You just saw it? Standing in the middle? When the going gets tough, are you checking the skill sheet on the equipment screen? Using equipment in combination can activate a variety of bonus skills. When battles start to get thorny, drop by a weaponsmith. You can buy equipment with new skills and use fusion to enhance your existing equipment. Don't hesitate to fuse equipment you consider weak. It might just lead you to new skills and new opportunities. Yeah, no. Weaponsmith Quatrand. Um, fuse. Let's go in and fuse some stuff. Amber spear. You're almost there. Um, well, actually, yeah, you're going to be done soon, so might as well just do it right now. Amber staff with attack. Yeah, whatever. Let's do that. So we can do. Weapon, amber earrings. Yeah, as well. Ribbon tie. Do that one. Amber circlet. Uh, tiara can't. Waistcoat. Let's do it with this one and then we can yeah we'll wait for that amber garment between the two might as well okay void ring void ring good okay and then Mangus sealed void ring with that one. Yeah. Might as well. Fire ring with that one. Okay. Earth ring. Um, let's do that one. Saves a little bit. Boots, battle boots. Yeah, that one seems to get the most stuff. Amber boots. Yes. Okay, and then these maxed amber boots can go on you. Okay. There we go. So now let's try on some goods. Yes, buy goods. Calcite staff, calcite paper, calcite umbrella, two of them. Um, yeah, let's buy those. Shop is familiar. Calcite ribbon tie. Let's buy one of those. Definitely an OTR. Uh, buy a circlet. Good waistcoat and then garment. Okay, and then boots. Oop, don't know if I meant to do that to equipment. Um Yeah, let's put these battle boots on instead of the calcite ones. Because basically I just want to be able to have more of the good stuff. 
rather than uh, have to hope for it. Like, have it on lock, able to equip whenever I damn well please, instead of uh, hope that I eventually get around to it. Uh, okay. And this leads seemingly I guess something like this is right. Chocolate Rusk. Calcite Sword. Good. Um, you definitely need to have that right now. Good. And then I get all of it. Yeah. I'm glad that it wasn't offered in the shop because otherwise it would have been a uh, waste of money. Gonna have to deal with you. Looks like someone right out of Xeno, too. Okay, have a life bottle. That'll be nice. Because hell, we know we use that now. We're so grateful for your help keeping the victims nourished. Your husband said he would watch over them a while longer. Hello. Seems like it's credible sightings. He must be closest by. Oh yeah, I made a new maps. Yeah, I'll buy it. Thanks for the business. Now I can continue on my journeys. Uh, Town of the Woods, yeah. I mean, it's 200 gold, but I mean, for a map that I might need. Don't, I'm not exactly 100% sure as to how the maps actually help all that much. But, I mean, just seems like the obvious better to have it than not situation. Uh, I was hoping for something to be around here, but like an herb or something. Would have been nice, but to no avail. Because I want Sori's palate to be so refined, to be so used to spices that he can pick them out of a lineup. Be like, what does chamomile taste like? And he'll be like, bitch, I know. I'm a connoisseur. Like this, this rosemary, tar attack flower, bada bing, bada boom. Piece of damage put by hidden arts, it's graphic arts, bada bing, bada boom. Wow, I've dumped so much into Sorry, but he is still not even like Max because art attack is not his like forte. But I don't care. It I all goes into the one guy. guy. That's how it works. If I want if I want him to do anything. That's what has to happen. Three types of art. Let's take a look at martial arts. They're quick to use. They can interrupt seraphic arts, but are weak to hidden arts. S, uh, SE consumption is fairly low. Number of hits is fairly high. Damage is determined by your attack and enemy's defense. Cool. Ooh, another one right there. I feel like that's the closest two we've ever seen. Okay, life bottle times two. Is that a monolith? Found ten more gold. Appears to be wisdom pertaining to your tongue. Partners, as described in the action section of the strategy menu, uh, are party members who can armatize with you using LB. If you'd like to customize how your partners sync up with you in battle, there's a good set of options to play with. Okay. And nothing new again. Okay, that's fine. Um, I am curious. These support talents. Money finding. Okay. So I'm wondering if maybe the amount of gold she finds is dependent on both one being in a town and two, um, the level of the skill. And I'm curious to know if it will ever be above merely 10 gold. Because like, 10 gold, I guess. Like, if you procs fast enough, uh, reduce physical damage. Uh, if it procs frequently enough i guess it would be good to have on just for long-term money but if it's not frequent enough then it's probably better to just get her to make snacks that you can sell shabby spear a testament to his refined workmanship the spear is valued at a high price hello don't worry grandpa neef is gonna take care of everyone you just get some rest neef neef we know neef Hello, friend. Your Highness, how on earth did you make it over here? No, never mind. We have more pressing matters at hand. Marland is in a dire situation. If you were to make your way to the sanctuary, they would tell you all you need to know now. You got it, bro. Hello, friend. There's a lot of people who can barely swallow, so it's probably better to keep the food as liquid as possible. Okay, gimme. Uh, calcite circlet. 
Okay, I think I have two of them now, which is actually nice because that means I'll be able to fuse them once they're both up, or at least one of them's full. So, no, oh, hello there. Lady Alicia, you made it safely. Indeed. I've brought medicine. What's happening? People are dying. We can do not stop the infection. The disease has spread to our ranks. We cannot even exterminate the wild dogs. At this rate, the entire kingdom may very well succumb to its ravages. Oh, hi, Patrick. That's Steve from Emperor. Stars. I know that voice. First, please distribute the medicine. Right away. <laughs> Things will be okay. They've got resources now. Yes. And we can help dispatch the hellhounds. Yeah. Let's go kill some dogs. Yes. I suspect that they are not the true source of this epidemic. Merely a symptom. A stronger Hellion, born of powerful malevolence. Okay. Hello. Go, ca uh, go catch some chai. Would you? Won't be any use anyone if you're dead. What's that? Who's that? Uh, I gotta keep myself from falling asleep. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, she's. Yeah. She. It hurts, mommy. <laughs> Make it stop. So, our daughter, she's dead. Why this happen? She was only just seven years old. What did she do to anyone? Oh, that's rough, man. This medicine isn't nearly enough to go around. Everyone will have to wait until Neef shows up. Capital's got to send reinforcements soon. I just hope we can hold out until they do. Oof. Hello, child. Yeah, God. Losing a seven-year-old kid. That's rough. But let's go kill some dogs that are infected with the plague. Oh, hello there. Big dragon. The dragon. Ah. No, it's just a hellion. You can tell because the humans don't see it. Oh. <laughs> ah, okay. It's landing over there. Time to go kill it. kill the hellion, yeah. I need preparation life bottle. Thank you. Don't tell me you're gonna fight it. It looks like a dragon to me. But it's a small dragon. We don't know that for sure. You can tell me if it gets too dangerous. Wonderful. And I wind up with all the responsibility as usual. Yes. Hundred <laughs> percent. That Hellion is called a Drake. It's a younger form of dragon. So we should take it out while well, we still can. It looks like the city's malevolence is energizing it somehow. Then we have to kill it while we still have time. Yep. Wait, don't, Alicia. Hold on. I mean, this is what was going to happen anyway. This was going to happen. Wait, Alicia, why are you putting the spear away? Why are we running? <laughs> we were coming... Th Everything about that said, hey, we're about to fight this bitch. And yet, we ran? That was close. Okay, that seems like a bit odd. And we ran back here. Sorry, we didn't mean to startle you. Huh. Again? Well, we gotta do something. You said that the malevolence in the city is energizing that thing, right? Probably. Hmm. Then we should focus on purifying the malevolence. Indeed. I expect that would naturally weaken the Drake. We didn't even try fighting it. Although it <laughs> sounds like a huge hassle. Well, you gotta break a few eggs to make an omelet. Ooh. The Go for an omelet. Good enough to me. That's some pasta and meatballs for, less so. for dinner tonight. It was good. Even if we do manage to weaken it, we can't fight it if we can't bring it down. We'll find a way to accomplish that, too. With everyone's help. Yeah, friendship. 
Well, it's rude. Times too. Slow and steady wins the race, Adnan. It's unlucky to open an umbrella indoors. Uh, yes, I prefer that metaphor to the one where we're eggs that go splat. <laughs> Time to begin operation slow and steady. Twirls the umbrella. Okay, gosh, she's making remedy preparations so fat. Jesus. What is your... Wow, well, like... Why are you able to do that so good? <laughs> or is it just re every time? Uh, okay, so there's one there and one over there. Okay, let's go by the one near the save point so I can save. Don't want to have to accidentally do all this again. Oh, hello there. Shall I help you carry those? No, I'm just fine. Books. The of Monmouth culture and the works of Sir Geoffrey. Wow, it's the first time I'm seeing you. These are valuable books. I'm hiding them away so they don't get lost or destroyed in the war. Oh, then all the more reason I should be help. It's fine. It's a classified location. I'm Jesus. <laughs> don't tell anyone about this. It's to protect the books. Okay. But remember, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, Something's off. I'm the guy. <laughs> you think so? Don't you? She was all excuses and we didn't even say anything. I certainly never heard of any such secret library. Okay. So, that's already suspicious. You stealing the books? You stealing the knowledge? Sky say the Holy Great Train. So this is Marland. It is a city rich in history, is it not? I believe even the Celestial Record mentioned it. Yeah, I always wanted to visit Marland, the city of knowledge nestled amongst the holy trees. Her shining branches are as a beacon unto the fruit of knowledge and the flower of aesthetics. There walks this continent no true scholar, no true artist who did not once frolic in its sylvan depths. Like how they well, both. It looks pretty rotten right now, if you ask. Like how they both pose sure identically. <laughs> Even so, she's right. Just like hands on hips. Maybe yes. So. The flowers will always bloom again in springtime, and bear their fruit in autumn. Indeed, the cycle will never end so long as there remains passion for knowledge and beauty, right? Very true. History has proven as such. I think you have flowers in your head or something. Don't you like flowers, Edna? I mean, they're fine. The pretty ones, at least. <laughs> Come on, just say you like it. D d stop being Sundere, just be cool. Okay, so that's that. Um, so we need to go over to the cemetery. Interesting, the one that was over here went away. Okay. Maybe after we did the initial star. Hey, sleeper. Uh, is it weird to date your imaginary friend from your schizophrenic episodes? I mean, yes. I, gu I guess I guess it would be weird to date them. However, Alicia's here and she's real, so we're fine. My daughter rests in peace in this cemetery. She loved books so much. Did you bury the books? Did you, did you dig up your daughter's grave to bury books to protect them? <laughs> Sorry, ex <-Miklia. laughs> Yeah, yeah. I understand you wanting to trust her, but something's wrong. Kind of funny to bury books in a graveyard. I'm similarly concerned. Let's hide and observe. Mm -hmm. All right. We gotta do snicket snag. Oh, no one can see us in our brightly colored garb between these grills. Oh. Uh -huh. Don't kid yourself, Agatha. That's worth a thousand at best. Who's there? Yeah. <laughs> What's she doing? So you lied to us about protecting the books? The fuck? It was always just my daughter and I barely getting by. I couldn't even give her one happy memory before she died. Haven't I suffered enough? Can I not have something good for once in my life? Not when you have to sacrifice knowledge. We're 
taking these back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you want to stay here, bud? <laughs> I'll be turning you into the guards for misappropriation and theft. <laughs> I always knew someday this was bound to happen. The malevolence is fading. I don't need this anymore. Do you think you can return it to Nath for me? <sighs> huh. Catching her quelled the malevolence? That's probably what she wanted deep down. To be brought to justice. I want justice. Well, I guess that proves that she really did love books after all. Earth dwellers are such a chore. We must bring people to justice to be able to quell the malevolence. Okay, and there's that star back. Okay, and that's... I got the library key. I don't know where the library is, but I got the key to it. <laughs> you know, speaking of keys, that's one thing that I never really understood. Like, oh, here's the key to the city, and it's like, what door does this key open? <laughs> Like, I feel like there should be some door that the key opens that only that, like, only the key to the city would be able to. <laughs> like, some stupidly large door that, like, doesn't really do much, but is just there for the sake of having the door to the, the key to the city. We going in? So, are you scared of ghosts, too? Oh, turns out this is the library. Would you like me to hold your hand? Hmm. It's not like that. You understand, don't you, Saray? Hmm, yeah, that place does kind of look ominous. I'm sensing a huge domain. There's definitely a strong hellion here. It could be hiding anywhere in the museum. We better canvas the entire area. Hmm, that is... See what I did there? Canvas is a fabric used as a painting service, and... Please stop. <laughs> just shut up. Oh, wow. I just got it. <laughs> okay. See, it was just enough explaining. Alicia, be a little bit quicker on the update. Looks like it. <laughs> Please. Please. <laughs> lavender. I have two lavender? What the fuck do you mean I have two lavender? There we go. No lavender. I don't need no lavender unless it's in my mouth. Because I need to be strong. Be a strong man. Coexisting with the Seraphim. So there's no Guardian Seraph here either. Looks like it. Got to fix I that. I want to assume that the entire world is like this, but... I think there are quite a lot of Seraphim who are less than fond of humans. I mean, you're Can evidently one. Is that hard for humans and Seraphim to coexist peacefully again? Do you really think that could happen? Must be nice living in a fantasy world. We are in a fantasy world. It's just a fantasy. But look at the reality. I understand that it may be difficult to achieve, sure. But in reality, there was a time like that in the past. There are records in the ruins and in the celestial record. When is this past you're referring to? Long, long ago. But even now, there are Seraphim like you, Edna. Huh? And we figured out that we could bring back the blessing as well. Yep. I think this is a step towards coexistence with the Seraphim and humans. I'll be counting on you, Edna. Selfish as ever. That's why I can't stand humans. Get used to it. Selfish types everywhere. Jeez. <laughs> selfish, selfish, selfish. Um, yeah, and there are the... Oh, wait, can I even... No, I can't because I don't have a uh, thing. See, that's also one kind of like I, it makes sense in game context, but it is kind of uh, annoying when it's like, hey, the thing that limits your ability to easily go between areas is the thing that you're probably going to be getting at like the end of each time you're hey, 75. OK, that's that's decent um, is the thing that you're going to be getting at the end of like each section's activities. <laughs> 
Memorization. Banish Blast leaves you particularly vulnerable, so it's perfectly natural to use it against stunned enemies. However, this also has a high chance to stun, so one possible attack is to unleash as a follow-up to a companion's attack. Of all the arts you can use when armatized, this alone has its damage determined by your attack and the enemy's defense. So choose your target wisely. Don't be an idiot. Don't be an idiot. D-O-N-T apostrophe in the middle of the N-N-T. I just saw a monolith written in ancient tongue. Oh, yeah? Blast Gauge. The most efficient way to build your Blast Gauge is to guard or evade enemies using quick steps while in normal state, not armatized. Note that attacking will not replenish your Blast Gauge. Okay, good to know. However, it will recharge with time, and certain skills will also allow you to recharge it through attacks. If you like to focus purely on attacking, you'd be wise to collect equipment with SC-type skills. Okay, so I'm going to have to be careful of that, because I thought attacking actually did increase it. But I was mistaken, like the fool that I am. Okay, so this is a side door. Okay, so before I go through here, let's... Nope, okay. So, wanted to check that because it seemed like it was the forward-facing way. Such important cultural artifacts. This is awful. We can't forget this. Versions equipped. Good. Okay. Come on, give me that. Apple gel. Oop. Scorpions. Is that really a scorpion? It's so large. But that makes it easier to hit, right? Nice. So I need to go into equipment, make sure everyone is not maxed on anything. You're maxed on battle garments. There we go. Get you a calcite garment. Okay, you're not max. You're maxed on tiara. Here's a calcite tiara. Good. Okay. Yeah, I I care more about his skill sheet than anything else. His all stats plus 20 is pretty darn good, but I mean, overall, it's not that big of a deal. Um, what? You got amber earrings. Um, okay, and I still need to unlock it, which is fine. Okay. Do I just have those rocks go around me? Do they block? Pretty decent. Must have been. If you're complimenting me. Nice. Okay. Because I'm still. Because <laughs> I'm still trying to get the the blast total, if I remember right. Uh, that's guard charges. Yeah. That, whatever. I still. Oh, I still need one more quick evade. That's one thing. Um, yeah, working on that. Blast, 500. Banish Blast. Yeah, I still need to do Banish Blasts for whatever that is. Quick Banish is pretty good. Um, but, yeah, Banish Blast is the big thing that I'm going for. Um, I should be able to just force one, one, uh, quick dodge. Pretty easy. 
Yeah, quick evade. What's going on? Step on wheat and wheat gain strength. Step on them and what takes place. Squash on their bellies and their guts pop out. Squishy and red flying out of their mouths. Huh. With sinister writings, it looks like they were scrawled in blood. Oop, jab me spear. Good. I have two of them. Dangerous encounter. Is it the same one we saw in the ruins? This one could be much stronger. You really seen hellions like this in that ruin? Okay, Floric Waistcoat. That was a difficult battle. Health Let's maintenance. Yeah. Okay, now I forget where we came in over there. Ah, okay. And this will open up the basically the shortcut. Good. Okay, and then that three ninety nine one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five, sixty eight. Okay, yeah. It's a pretty good amount. Battle action, nice, so I can check that out. Proficiency is equipped. Proficiency is increased, okay. Um, battle action. Pushful guard. Can evade arts, rapid attacks, even when front stepping. However, SP consumption increases by 10. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? Um, tactical, yeah. Uh, conditions, do a thousand battles, that one's working, 54, I'm almost that bad, don't know what it is, and then I'm about fourth of the way. So half to that, fourth to that, um, and of course, all the other stuff. Uh, let's go this way, because this way seems like a dead end. Okay, equip. See, I wish when it said proficiency increased, it would tell you if it's like proficiency mastered. That way you would know, hey, I need to go in and check. <laughs> um, apple gel. Um, yeah, no reason to discard it. Life bottle, cool. Yum. Da, 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 do, do, do. Yeah, well, it's it's nice playing a Tales game where I don't feel like I need to be using items every every other battle. Saffron, art defense, thank you. Mm -hmm. 
that was one thing in Symphonia and Vesperia where it was like, holy shit. It's like every fight felt like, oh yeah, I need to make sure I have full apple gel and all that stuff or else I'm just not going to be uh, doing very well. Sorry, my phone is still on sound mode instead of vibrate because I have it on sound when I work from home. Uh, effect potential. Various things can increase effect potential. Two times chance to inflict ailment when enemy is weak against the attack element. Four times chance to inflict ailment when enemy stats have been reduced by an element. Two times chance of effect from antagonistic attack types. Two type chance of effect from combos chained off of a banish blast. Chance increased when your SC is high. 1.4 times chance for arts chained off of quick step. Interesting. It's a lot of ways in which to try and get it snack preparation soft serve ice cream okay calcite boots swing the blade once cut off the right hand swing it again there goes the left hand the wicked thief cries out in pain it hurts it hurts he screams in vain swing the blade once more and cut off their head the thief goes silent the thief is, is dead a statue of the shepherd what senseless vandalism assholes <laughs> Thing to be had there? No? Okay. Just, <laughs> just some just some webs. Oop. Victory shall be mine. Ready? No escape. I got you. Focus your efforts. Blade bang. Okay, let's item life bottle. Spare. That felt good. That was <laughs> the fact that Edna went down. Okay. Good. So Ray tends to get into danger. Please help him. Of course. Leave it to me. Yeah. <laughs> the two trustworthy ones. <sighs> it's like, I entrust you to not be an idiot. Okay, you got it. I can try that. Good. Yeah, it would be good to rest and give me all that nice grade. Chew and swallow, rend meat with teeth, the evil ones taste juicy and sweet. Eat their flesh and suck bones dry, not one scrap we'll leave behind. What is this about? Good. in a day you know snacks there okay be a vista point nearby okay. there we go statue of the conqueror statue of a noble this being statue it radiates such dignity you can tell from his expression that he must have been a great warrior <laughs> a fine man i would like to see his entire body he was probably oh, ripped but wouldn't he be 
more or less naked? More yes. Or less unattractive in an aesthetic sense. I want to see it. Well, it's true that the perfectly toned body of a warrior may be aesthetically pleasing, but Alicia, unladylike. <laughs> no, I only meant it as a generalization. I really have no personal interest mm -hmm. in that. Oh, sort yeah. of thing. Sure. Not at all, huh? I mean, not much. Just enough. The uh, normal amount. Wow, settle down. It's just a statue. Seriously. <laughs> Though it's true that King Claudin epitomizes the warrior ideal. Hold on. <laughs> I agree. King Meliodas, right? Not King Claudin. What? But then it wouldn't match with the style at all. Yes, because this bust was carved as a speculation on the style of future generations. I think your interpretation is a bit far fetched. <laughs> well, I think you're trapped in stereotypical views. All right. Look. Let's drop our preconceptions and start over then. Can we identify the subject? What features stand out? <laughs> wow, settle down. It's just a statue. Seriously. <laughs> That's great. It's like, okay, man, we're both history buffs. Let's, let's, take, let's take this from the top. Let's figure this shit out. <laughs> okay. Versus them being like, ooh, would you want to see that man meat? Yeah, bro. That man meat would be so good. Yeah. There we go. You ready, sir? Okay. Let's start on this one. Nope. Level up. Though it would be good to rest. Now oh, you're fine. Your HP is at max. Usually increased. Okay, AP increased by one. Nice. Let's come over here. Just do a quick go through. Natural waistcoat. Let's get the yeah. Let's get the calcite up. Ooh, and it also increases your total BG count from three to four. That's nice. That's nice. Mm. Uh, okay, yoink, open that door, please. Good. Very well. Come at me, Nate. Bang. I will fight evil. Focus your efforts. Nope. Are you serious? Get it out. There we go. I don't understand the social hierarchy of humans. Aren't there ranks or Cossack hierarchies paper. among the seraphim? Well, if you must know, whoever makes the best jokes is ranked. Pretty sure that's your rule. It's not. It's not an end all be all rule. Whoever makes the best jokes. <laughs> See, I feel like the I feel like the better comeback to that is. Oh, so you must be ranked pretty low. <laughs> Okay, you guys, you can, you can stop laughing. It's not that funny. Uh, okay, we are just up on the balcony. Up on the balcony. Slow and steady, right? Is this the place important to the king? Hey, Alicia, the ring on the wall. Do you think we did right by Agatha? Slow and steady, right? We should search every street and alleyway. I expect we will find the source of the town's wildlife. It's not too much trouble. This place important to the kingdom. The Millennium Museum was home to many valuable Highland artifacts and works of art. It pains me to find it inside a state of ruin. Hey, Alicia, the rang on the wall. Y yes, it concerns me too. Who would write such eerie nonsense? And in blood, no less. Whoever it is, clearly they are deeply disturbed. Do you think we did right by Agatha? Uh, through her, we are one step closer to discovering the truth behind how malevolence is formed. We can only hope that being found out today will ultimately lead to her salvation. I finished preparing the gel. Aw, oh, yeah, give me that apple gel. Didn't even use any, I don't think. I think I was still maxed. Eh, been maxed uh, for a while. For a while. Um, okay. Yeah, I should probably get into the habit of... Is that a monolith? Using, um... Okay. 
in the habit of using the uh ah there we go using snacks before um uh using snacks before like going into a boss fight our attack by by two see i don't know if this is like even a good item to be using on him but i figure if i boost it it'll help when he's like all super formed so whatever <laughs> Containing combo effects. If your combo is interrupted, you may briefly find that further attacks are rendered ineffective. And then try to restart your attack. It's better to get your footing and ready for the enemy's counterattack. After all, you're probably low on SC at this point. True. The new thing? No. Okay, soft serve ice cream. Surprisingly hard to shape correctly. Ice cream with lots of vanilla, dude. Vanilla is such a good flavor. Like, it's such a. <laughs> it's such like a. It, it's such like a universally enjoyed flavor. Like people are like, oh, it's vanilla. And it's like, bitch, that shit's great. You know how hard it is to find a flavor that just everyone likes? Um, okay, let's have soft serve. Right now. Go in. Because that affects the next fight, which seems like it will be a... Um, Seems like it'll be a... Wait, actually... Did that not save? No, does it... Wait, why did that... Did it save for the middle? Or... How does this work? <laughs> does it auto-go around? I don't know. But yeah, using the ice cream right before a good fight would be nice. Because it'll help... Keep everything good. Okay. Oh. Good camera angle. Interesting. Oh, hello there. Big knight. Hello there, knight man. Okay, what are you weak to? Your weakness is... A... I suppose this hell will must be the source. Lucky for you, it isn't a ghost, Nick Leal. I told you it's not like that. Save it for later. Did not mean to be. How there we go. Just hit it from distance. Oh. Huh? You fought us? I, uh, sorry. You attacked us, bro. What the heck? I like your helmet, though. What a fool I was. I should have realized you would be here, attack. Attack? Attack? Oh, my goodness! It's pretty Lady Lila. How you been? <laughs> Hello. Oh. <laughs> friend of yours? We know each other. It was a long time ago. My name's Attack. She used to please ya. That's a weird name. Well, aren't you rude? Don't you know that Attack is a Norman name of the highest pedigree? Oh, it's a Norman. It's unfancy. <laughs> I'm fancy. 
<laughs> it looks I like them. Sort of like the thing attached to Edna's umbrella. Let's save talk of Edna's thingy for later, shall we? That one's a particularly long story. It, is it? it is? What? <laughs> is it? Hey, Lyra, <laughs> what's a Norman? They're a special kind of seraphim. Oh, so they are seraphim. They aren't quite as powerful as a lord of the land, but they can still be a help to other seraphim. How? <laughs> Great question. Well, they have the ability to boost another seraph's power. They're kind of like a maid of sorts. That's my Lila. You know me like the back of your lily white hand. <laughs> nope. Like a maid? I'm afraid I'm not so sure I get it. Lila's explanations can be pretty off the cuff. <laughs> Silly Billies like you could never understand what Lila and I mean to each other. <laughs> I'm not sure I want to understand. Yeah, no. It's a bit weird. Well, anyways, y'all are Lila's friends and all. Maybe I can treat you to some grub. Okay. Huh? Uh, learn a new art, got an anomalous orb, learn a new battle action. Cool. Grow proficiency, title level. Good. Okay, so you learn a new art. Torrent Fang. Cool. Absorb SC. You, do you have anything new? No. Good. Uh, equipment. Sure, nothing is maxed. Yeah, nothing is. Silhouette half and half. Click the damage is half. Used only if you really want it. So this is good only when you are trying to get that combo thing up, but you're killing things too fast, I feel. Um Yeah, so I have no reason to use that myself. Banish blast, I am halfway there, which is good. Um a thousand armorizations. That's just like some of the like the thousand ones. I have to think that either you are going to be getting into a lot of combat in this game, that or you are Let's prepare for our next battle. you are very specifically just going to weak, weak, weak enemies and going. Yep. Okay. Here we go. I'm just going to continuously uh, <laughs> encounter them, and I have a means of getting uh bg real quick so i can just armatize and do it over and over and over that way um, Nicholas, sunlight girl jean luke's boom boomer uh, this is a massacre who could have done such a thing yeah well you did you turned into a hellion mm. bitch Good Remember, thing. it was me. Good thing we purified you. I went out of my head, tore my beloved treasures apart, and I now they're gone forever. Oh. <laughs> I feel like I've heard this voice actor actress's <laughs> this kind of voice before, but I cannot place it for the life of me. Okay. Okay. Hello there. Stop crying, bro. Not while you're wearing that cool helmet. Please. What on earth happened that made you turn into a Hellion? I'm sure it's hard for you, but can you tell us about it? I'm an art connoisseur. Got to whittle my days away, just people watching and gazing at fine art. I wasn't worshipped or nothing, but I weren't lonely neither. Sounds like a good life. Yeah, that's what you like doing. I was happy, <laughs> real happy. But then, <laughs> it's gonna leave us there, bro. What the fuck? 
You can't just leave us there. You can't just walk away. That's rude. Continue the conversation. You a-hole. I thought you were just gonna walk decently far away, Dad. God damn it. He's out of it here. Where are ya? Where beest thou? But ever since the countries took to fighting, the, the humans started to get real nasty. That country's bad, they'd say. That country's art is bad. Slash it. Burn it. So they used art just as fuel for the fires of war. It's true. And that is the half of it. <laughs> That's when they started to move the art from the black market. Oh, so that's where it all went. They were laughing and clutching their money in their, their grubby little hands. Hooray for war! Hooray for profit! I got so mad, so dejected, I felt my anger bubbling up, but I was beyond caring. And then... That's when I became a Hellion. <laughs> he turned into a pretty cool knight-looking thing. It's not your fault, Attack. Thanks, son. <laughs> Thanks, son. I'm curious as to what this character's voice was in, like, the Japanese dub, if it was still, like, a high-pitched, cute kind of voice, or if it was more like a old voice. Like, thanks, son. I never thought that the source of all that malevolence would be the love of art. Yeah, that was unexpected. It's the Kingdom of Highland that caused attack such pain. If only I had been able to do something. Malevolence can come from anyone's spirit. Especially when that spirit holds hate for other people. Just poking the ground. <laughs> As Seraphim, the influence we receive from the vessel in particular can be a danger. So if I started generating malevolence, it would put everyone in danger? All of us could become Hellions. Damn. you would be the sickest Hellion squad ever. so powerful Saray, Alicia the people in their despair cling to those with power that surpasses theirs far more tightly than you may imagine do not undervalue your ideals nor the things that are in your power to accomplish a shepherd's emotions towards the people he rescues are also his greatest enemy in a way okay understood got it didn't she just tell you not to be so stiff and serious no. Okay, gotta be, right. gotta be loosey goosey. Eh, tee hee. <laughs> but I suppose I don't need to worry about you. We'll get started so you don't have to. Just doing what's within our power, right? Right. Time to go kill the Drake. The bastard. Let's go get them. Um, okay. Purify the Malevolence and Marland. Is that not... Did I not do that? Okay. Um, yeah, and I already checked. Um, okay. Did I? Yeah, I already got this one, right? Yeah, I was. That one's so, uh, yeah, because I even mentioned, like, oh, that's. I think that's the two closest, uh, pillars that I've seen to each other. Okay, so where am I? 
Where am I going right now? Am I going back to the back to the sanctuary? There you go. Yo, 123 gold? That's that's a pretty penny. Okay. Verify. Nope. Do I need to go get the rest of the medicine? Or is him saying he wants to be alone for a while a uh, more of a I say it but don't really mean that you need to be alone for a long while? More just Hey, I need you to go away for a hot sec. Okay, so no, I need to go after the small little things. Well, I wish you had told me that. I wanted to do that earlier. No? Oh, okay. Well, that's good to know. Wish you had indicated that that was what I needed to do. But hey. Could have done that earlier. <laughs> but, hey, at least this is a halfway decent spot to be doing it from because it's at the end of a path. So it's a bit easier to make sure I don't miss anything. But hey, at least we figured it out. No indication of what you are supposed to be doing is sometimes... It's, uh, weird. Because it'd be one thing if the game never told you what you were supposed to be doing. But other times the game tells you pretty clearly, hey, go here, do this. Having the... Uh, having that be, like, a lopsided aspect where it's like, hey, sometimes we're going to give you clear direction and other times we're not makes it unclear when I'm supposed to be kind of taking action on aspects like in the area or I'm just supposed to be moving around and going somewhere else like that's the that's the difficult part right that's why I think that if I were to probably change anything I'd be like okay here's what you're gonna do you're gonna put a star on each of these dragon heads or whatever as soon as you exit the library and get that cutscene of the Drake going overhead. Or it's like, okay, go and get, that means you have to do something with these. Like, you don't necessarily tell them, hey, use the fire on them, but like, hey, something. Like, anything to indicate that action is required. Versus them just previously being there and you couldn't really do anything about it, I think. I didn't try to use the fire on it when I came in, so. Can't 100% say for certain, but I'm willing to bet that it probably didn't do anything. Or more likely it did something, but they would just respawn anyway. At which point, the point stands. And arguably it would give it a different idea because it would be like oh previously i couldn't do anything about it so you'd have to Guess just that's all the hellhounds in yeah, town there we go the epidemic here should settle at least a little bit now yeah but only momentarily it was not done in vain the malevolence has subsided considerably just yeah. like the malevolence has been lifted somewhat don't you think yeah indeed it has but we still need to find a way to bring the drake down Saray, can you head to the base of the great tree? Sure. Huh? Oh yeah, sure. Gonna make a tree crossbow? That'd be pretty cool. Okay. I'm just gonna turn this entire tree into just a massive gun that's going to shoot the hell out of that Drake. Um, okay, let's operate under the assumption that the Drake is going to immediately fight us. Um, let's increase our defense. Yeah, let's increase our defense. Just in case shit goes wrong. Plan to 
do, Edna? Wait here. Yeah, because I'm starting to see the snacks more as the one-time boost of the stats versus the heal. Because with the health maintenance, it's like, oh, the heal doesn't really matter. I'll just get it by walking around. And encounters are spaced out enough that it's like, okay, most of my health can come back before I get to a second encounter. I wonder where Edna went off to. Great question. Who knows what goes on in her head? I'm back. Umbrella. What is wrong with you? Huh? Went and got him. Uh, attack? Hello. I'm here to help. Heard tell you folks could have used it an extra jolt of power. Oh, that's that's uh We just might. If I combine attack's power with my arrows, that's we can bring down the drake. Daichi slash uses his voice actor doing a cute voice. Think. Use them again. <laughs> if this plum bum town gets back on its feet, folks might finally remember the place of art in a civilized society. Thank you, Edna. I just thought it might work. <laughs> She's shy. Hiding her face with the umbrella. Come down here, Drake. Oh, here it comes. Going to kill you. Dark, I can barely see it. That's a good thing. You can fight without worrying about humans catching sight of you. Hey, good thinking. So, how exactly should we go about shooting this thing down? That I don't know. Just ask it to land again? Tonight's supposed to be a full moon. All we need is some light. The clouds are receding. Let's look for a place where we can aim our shot with the aid of the moonlight. Okay. I would think right around here, but yeah. It's right in front of this house. This is it. Ah, okay. Get on top of the roof. Oh yeah, he has a bow. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> Attack. You got it. Norman power. <laughs> Norman power. Yo. One shot is enough. <laughs> Sarai, I'll do the aiming. One shot, one kill. Right. And I'll pick when to fire. <gasps> now! It's in front of the moon! Yo. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> nice. GG. Let's go kill it. Or purify it, at the very least. Because, yeah, it's a, it's a dragon, or a drake, so it has to be at least a it's quasi-strong. Um, weakness, wind, resistance, literally the other ones. Even a mere drake is this big and this strong? You can't be serious. Hope you should know the difference in size and scale a dragon has by now. We are here to do whatever must be done. That's right. As we are now, we can do it. Whatever. Try not to die out there. Okay. Can you please use a life bottle? Sorry for the trouble. Uh, okay. Maybe I was. Maybe it was wrong of me to uh, tell them to.
Okay, you please. You can use an apple gel on you. Okay. Please, life bottle on you. Right. Uh, please. Sorry for the trouble. Ocean Blitz! That's your result! Good. You did it! Oof. You beat the dragon! That was rough. It was just a great. Sure, we might not be strong enough to beat a dragon yet, but. Yeah! One day! We will get there someday! That. That was rough. Land 30 hits, used 3 BG, reduced time on attack, one against a powerful foe, KO'd eight times, minus 7.75. Yeah, that was my new art. My, ooh, sorry, you got new art. So I finally have four. Blessing Orb, Moon Mass Talisman, Nimble, Tile Princey increased. Cool. Nice. So, yeah, pass. A flame's purification. Might you be the shepherd? Yes. <laughs> so you must be Marlin's. <laughs> Lord Lord of the light. Rohan. Rohan. Or should I say, I was. I very nearly became a dragon. I have no right to continue protecting this town. Don't say that. Seraph Rohan. I am Alicia Difta, Princess of the Kingdom of Highland. It is we who must bear the blame. We who corrupted the hearts of the people and set you on the path to becoming a Hellion. But I assure you that I shall set things right. If you must punish anyone, let it be me. No one will be punishing anyone. If it's still possible, let us have your blessing just this once. You're an impassioned young princess, I'll give you that. You can see me? Yes, I have pledged myself as Saray Squire. Have you? And you're okay? Huh? Oh. <laughs> we still don't know what it means. <laughs> like, we haven't been told about the side effects or anything else. Lowered significantly. Yeah, now it's only a few dots here and there. You're the one who dispelled it? Yeah. We all did. We worked together. Hmm. Then so be it. I'll extend my blessing. Damn well better. I want to help too. Thank, Thank you. you so much. It appears the corruption has yet to spread to this tree. Using this as a vessel, I shall expand the blessed domain. Yo, trees! You got it! Norman Flower! Aww. Aww. It's a holy tree! Aww. It's a big tree! What happened? There's still a mega 
a powerful Hellion running around near here. No oh, shit. The domain it's creating is in the way, and we can't stop the invasion of the lesser Hellions. A major Hellion? Where? To the southwest. It isn't far. Saray, we must defeat it. But if we leave the town in this state... With your guards all a-sleeping and your Hellions all a-creeping... Saray! Sorry, I just blanked out for a second there. You okay, man? You need a rest. In. Now. Indeed. Good ideas will surely come after we take a breather. Hmm. The young shepherd's starting to deteriorate. I ought to be more understanding. Oh. Deteriorate? I wonder. Blessing for my region has been restored. I wonder, does that mean I want to improve talent, I want to learn talent, for, learn talent Norman for the win? So I wonder if that means that um, that means that um, every uh squire like somehow draws the power or like life out of uh out of him Norman for the win uh detect previously undiscovered norman nearby raise level to extend range set on multiple characters to extend range Ooh, interesting this time i like to see the presence of norman in your vicinity i mean that's just i feel like that's a smart thing to have Going on. Lila, darling, you really found yourself a piece of a shepherd. <laughs> Good on you. Why, thank you. You two go way back, don't you? There was a time once when the Norman Seraphim and I traveled together. Lila was like an idol to us. At one point, all forty-nine of us begged her to make us her sublords. All forty-nine. You didn't go for it. Um, no. That's a bit much. Let's all just be friends, she told us. What a cruel woman. <laughs> well, 49 is a bit much. The trauma nearly killed us. We all scattered over the globe to be alone with our melancholy. What? Surely that wasn't necessary, you mm -hmm. sadistic harpy. <laughs> I don't think I'm a harpy. Ah, it's all good. Us Norman, we roll with life's punches. We all treasure it as a bittersweet memory from when we was carefree young'uns. This nostalgia trip is boring me, but it's true that Norman had useful abilities. If we find any more, let's catch him. <laughs> let's catch them all. They turned into hellions. I'd get a kick out of seeing my old buddies again. I promise we'll help you folks out. Okay, so go around the world to find hellions. Speak. Lower the land menu. Okay. Save point travel set boons. Travelers oppose. Kings boon go. Yep. Okay, treasure restoration. Leave treasure for some time. Hellion detection. Yeah, I want that. Healing air. Set Norman. Set Norman to serve lower the land, making dropped items in the area more likely to have that Norman skill in. Ooh, interesting. Set Norman. You can assign Norman to serve lower the land, bringing chance of finding equipped with that Norman skill attached. However, this will also raise enemy levels in the area based on that skill's group. And then low level enemies won't give you as much experience, so this is one way to keep enemy levels higher. Interesting. Attack plus four. Enemy level one. So, adds one level, I guess. Um. Offer items. Ice pot. Okay, interesting. Um, oh, yeah, what did I set boons? Boon cut. What did I? Grade to grade. Did I need to get grade up to? Yes, I need to get the grade up to be able to get to be able to get the boons. Um, okay, offer items. Uh, on, on, on. Yeah. Do 
that. Yeah, I can probably apple gel. Let's do two of those because we're making them. next level good uh set boons healing air cover rate will be boosted by 20 percent when you eat snacks um sure might as well not i don't really need to leave any um any boon costs out um okay so so let's hold that and let's get on over to the inn Rest at the inn for the night, please. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I'm curious to know how long it's going to take for them to give us all the good deets on <laughs> this condition we got, basically. Putting slots to use. The Normans' powers sure are interesting. Not as much as their faces, though. Yes, the Normans' ability to assist is quite helpful, and each one has different capabilities. They all look the same, though. Its abilities change from combining them in different ways, right? They have bad attitudes, even though they're Norman. Yes, there should be increasing numbers of Norman which you could combine to make new effects. Norman times Norman equals Norman hell. <laughs> you sure have it in for the Norman, Edna. I hate Not really. Just a bone or two to pick. By which I mean 77 confrontations, 108 complaints, and 32 appeals. That's all. Sounds complicated. 32 appeals? Lila and Edna's skill lecture. Could you tell me more about equipment skills? Way to have your head in the game. First, let's go over the basic skills. Basic skills can be broken down into ten groups with five different elements. So in total, it's ten times five. Think you can do the math, genius? Fifty. There are fifty Norman named after the basic skill they offer. Each one has the power to draw forth that specific skill. So if you find a skill that you like, Go find that Norman and send them off to the Lord of the Land to do your dirty work. Elements and skill groups aren't just for tweaking the effects of your skills. They're also closely linked to bonus skills. <laughs> That's all the time we have for today. See you again next week. Next week? We're doing this again? Okay. <laughs> Interesting. I was not expecting that. <laughs> See you again next week. Okay. And let's... Okay. Did that. Yeah, the the Drake fight wasn't too bad, but I'm definitely I can definitely feel that I'm on the moderate difficulty because shit is hard. Um, battle actions, uh, quick evade, yeah, highest total damage while armatized. That shouldn't be too bad. Quick evade like that. This one isn't happening. I can tell you that. Um, guard charges. I mean, this one is definitely on pace because guard charging is just easy to do when you do it pretty quick um but combo hit that one's gonna probably be a while until we get just multi-hit like attacks um thousand battles that might happen getting closer to this and yeah, obviously getting closer to this as well these two are tied um blasts that one probably will happen but probably late late in the game um high cell damage forty thousand. yeah that one, that one's gonna be tough. And Banish Blasts, that one shouldn't take too much longer, hopefully. Uh, Alicia, you look kind of tired. Thank you, but I'm fine. And you, tonight was quite the idea. Maybe we could all rest at the inn. Um, is this not the door to the inn? Like, let me, let me in. There we go. I've been showing being mean to me. Uh, okay, nothing to talk to. Speak. Inns. By resting an inn, you fully recover HP and SC. While in an inn, you can choose to eat a meal, after which, for a set number of battles, you'll be able to earn bonuses by fulfilling certain conditions in battle. Bonuses will vary based on the meal. Some skits are triggered at inns. Uh, pork and potatoes. Cheese risotto. Dude, risotto's delicious. Veggie sticks. Mabo curry bun. Uh, 12 battles. When the whole party's HP is below 80, restore 15. After 30 seconds of battle time, restore 40 HP. Cures process when pra paralyzed. That's not bad. When KO cures KO, restores 20% of HP. That's really good. 
It's fusion of fusions. Pork and tofu and curry and bread and delectable mabo curry bun format. Dude, I had... When I was in Japan, I had, like, a like a, a roll of bread, like I got from a bakery, that had, like... It was, like, curry bread in it. Oh, it was so good. <laughs> and I did have a, um... Uh, what well, was like a, a nikuman, which is like the the pork bun from uh, like a kombini, which was delicious. I had, I had two. I had a regular one and like a special edition one. Not on the same day, but uh, here I'll do this one because one is cheap and two goes for quite a few number of battles. Okay, so we go and get story. The game. How are you feeling? Better. Right as rain. Good. We don't need a sick shepherd. That'd be bad. Man. And precisely how long had you been saving that one? <laughs> For a while. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we've got our saray back. Clippity cloppity. Get shepherd. off our property. Perfect timing. Hey, how's it going? A guild. We've heard about the bridge. You're a superstar. Well, you know. Your pants you are know? weird pants. Well, whatever. Anyway, we need you to sign for this. Huh? Me? What is it? More medicine. Ah. Okay. It was ordered by a guy named Nate. See, buck up. We got this. <laughs> I guess you're right. And why am I signing for it? Also a message. I found a group of mercenaries headed toward Marlin and asked them to protect the town, but they refused me. I have asked for additional reinforcements from Lady Lake, but it will take some time. That's all. Mercenaries. They might work in a pinch. Can mercenaries stand against the Hellions? Probably not the Hellhounds, but they might be able to handle lesser Hellions. They are vicious, but they are visible. And little. But they already refused the guard job. Mm -hmm. I could try asking again as sincerely as possible. Wouldn't hurt to go try. <laughs> I mean... Thanks we need someone to watch the town while we go kill the big hellion. Hey, why are you going through all this trouble anyway? I'm the shepherd! Why? I mean, you can't just not help people in trouble. Hmm. Sure you can. I get it. I get that you're weird. Now, where is the medicine going? The sanctuary. Yeah, take it to the church. Oh, hey, you didn't happen to run into a group of mercenaries on the way here, did you? You mean the woodsmen? They came with us. The woodsmen? I think they're probably still in town. They said they were going to stock up. But they weren't going to guard the town. <laughs> zoom, zoom, zoom. Okay. Eight pork and potatoes. Yeah, it's pork and taters. Dude, I'd, like, honestly, if I could go for some, like, beef stew right now, ooh, that'd be tasty. Yum. Oop. Lila and Edna's skill lecture. Groups. Now then, this time we'll be covering skill groups. We are not going to talk about bonus skills? We are the ones doing the teaching around here. <laughs> Shut up and listen. Oh, okay. Yes, ma'am. It wouldn't be prudent to explain everything at once, so I'll start off with the ones you can obtain in the beginning phases. So first, there's the status column. This increases basic stats by a certain percentage. Here, it's wise to improve upon your given strengths. Then there's the HP column. If you're prone to damage, it's best to improve on this. Or just don't get hit in the first place, doofus. <laughs> Be good at Anyways, dodge. As you can see, aligning the same skill group together to carry out a tactical battle is one option that you have. And that's where the bonus skill comes into play. See you again next week. Next week again? God damn, all these weeks! <laughs> that one wasn't even too that one wasn't even like all that impressive of a thing. Hey there. Get your supplies. 
can't be wasting time in a crazy town like this one. What happened? Wild dogs were attacking the sanctuary, but these guys put them down. <laughs> yeah, it is just dogs. I gotta admit, that was some fine teamwork. I thought Hellions couldn't be killed by regular people. Those dogs are Hellions. And no pushovers either. Well, for a human anyway. Excuse me. They May need I the purifying you? flame. Huh? You're talking to the woodman, bub. We don't do babysitting. And we won't get your kitty out of a tree. Oh. It's about a job only you guys can handle. I'm the leader, Lucas. What's this job you speak of? We want you to protect Marlin for a little while. Yeah, we were asked that before, but turned it down. Ain't taking no chances guarding over a place that's diseased. Which, I mean, like... Fair, but also, why are you here? You're talking to is the shepherd. <laughs> like, the miracle bridge maker, this scrawny little duckling. Oh, uh, do I have to fight him? Chain, right? <laughs> we found a way to bring Marlin back to how it was, but we have to leave town to do it. And the guards here aren't in a condition to fight because of the epidemic. So, you want us to handle it, huh? We do the grunt work so you can get the glory. Is that how it is? It's nothing of the sort. Huh, so you say. What do you need? Yeah, Let right. Let me tell you something, Mr. Shepherd. Money talks and horse crap walks. Hmm. <laughs> They're mercenaries. If you're serious about it. Put your cash on the table, then we'll talk. Costs 5,000 gold to employ the woodsman. How about it, Mr. Shepherd? Did I? F it. We need it. Well, well. Looky here. The shepherd comes through. Don't know if there was a cheaper way to do it, but. I can't trust you after all. You trust whoever gives you money? Yeah. And what else, pray tell, could be my motivation? I am a mercenary. Duty, chivalry. Let's say this epidemic kills one of my subordinates. Will duty and chivalry step in to take care of his grieving family? W well <laughs> But if I have money, I can uh -huh. make sure they've got a safety net. That's the kind of contract I have with my team. And that's why in return, they're willing to put their lives on the line. Okay, so the Hellions aren't dead. They're just <laughs> they, Okay, so they Maybe were not able to kill them. Reality, sister. Facing reality, huh? So, you want us to guard the town, huh? We'll take the job, but on one condition. In return... Can we do whatever we want to this town while you're away? Okay, that's... Saray, are you sure about this? It's fine. No one who values contracts so highly would do anything sleazy. the test all right you bums we got a job to do the staying in marland and guarding it alpha and bravo squad secure the perimeter charlie handle things in town i'll go tell the guards what's up these orders come from the shepherd himself don't slack off out there okay ah! you're a cool guy lucas <laughs> i i can appreciate you <laughs> Oh, cool. What's this? Your change. It's our policy to accept a reasonable price for the job we do. Well, they're cheaper than we imagined. We may not look it, but we value our customers. Cool. Thanks, man. Should we really quickly use two? Th okay, so it was half that. Uh, how much gold do I have? Eleven thousand. Okay. Need to scare this down to us. We're on top of things. Make sure you handle your end of the bargain. Okay, so Mount the Great City, defeat the Hellion southwest of Marland. Okay, so we need to go down over there. Hello. D 
defense. Oh, uh, okay. Attack, defense. Okay. Any equipment with open skills, I can make it nice and pretty. Oh, so the first time you find one, it just adds it. Interesting. Mm, mm, I see. Um, yeah, sure. Defense, I had a shabby spear. This will fix you good if you need more, just summon me to the low of the land. Oh, Norman, Norman, you find a variety of locations. Norman have the power to enable skill effects for the same skill as their name. Find Norman in each area and present them with equipable items that have open skill slots so they can attach their skill to. Use the lower land menu to configure your Norman. Defense now serves the Lord of the Land. Defense. You must defend yourself. Falkwin Hillside. Let's uh, save. 2104. Good. Okay, let's get some combat. Hello there. So this is the power of purification. My powers aren't much, but I try. Uh, control character took Ah, oh, okay, that's nice. Norm for the wind. Talent. Norm for the wind. This talent alerts you to the presence of Norm in any vicinity. Yes. Okay. That's yes. We do. We know this. Um, okay. So we need to go southwest over to there. Hey, yo! Get over here. Good. Let's do this. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Good. Looks like we win. Proficiency increased. Good. This is that that one too many hits were going on and it just did not know how to uh handle. And paper, calcite paper. There we go. Okay, you're almost maxed on all your shit, because your stuff all came in new, so we didn't need to change anything. But once you pop, you're going to have to uh, get all your stuff bumped up. Oh, hello there. Glavend Basin. Interesting. Over on these sides? No? Okay. How's it going, friend? Tension is mounting with Rollins to the west. According to Gaven, has been blocked off. Now scram. Um. Huh. Okay. Not what I was expecting, so I guess I need to. Yes, it's just a big one that's around what level of 16. Oh, hello there. Aren't you? I didn't notice you. Mine. Got any equipment with open skills? I can make it nice and pretty. Um, ancient staff. Calcite paper. Calcite staff. So they're pretty frequent. Doesn't seem like they're really hiding all that much. Victory, Just need to find them. Good. So Ray tends to get into danger. Good. So I think. Find that big one. Everyone, okay? Good. Uh, 
life bottle. So where they said southwest of Marlin. I took that as the southest west, but maybe it was that big one that I couldn't do before. whole bunch of these fights. Sorcerer's capabilities as a shepherd. Well, I think he's quite talented. I think you're kind of overrating him. And his friendship with you makes it all the better. I think you're definitely overrating that. <laughs> <laughs> you are overrating his friendship. Okay, so I'm gonna hope that maybe that's the southwest of Marland. Oh, okay, there's a cave down there as well. Okay, well, let's try this one. Bad because I don't want to get KO'd here. Um, yeah, unfortunate. Uh, yeah, let's do that. That'll help a bit. Oh, holding R1 puts that up. That's nice. It tells me what effects I have, number of fights that I have with it. That's good. And okay, so I guess I just missed <laughs> missed the cave. Because to me, maybe where I need to go, I would consider more southeast instead of southwest. But I guess it is southwest in general, but more southeast facing. My hair standing on end. There's something lurking deep inside here. Yes, even I can sense something wrong. Plantis. Okay. It's a moving plant? Hellions don't always reside in animals. Can't say hair, man. I don't think that's true. <laughs> I can sense the ancient tongue. We're near one. Elements and stats, for example, when fighting enemies weak against fire, you have two times chance to reduce their art attack. They are also two times as likely to be inflicted with burn. Weak against fire, yeah. As the turn top, you're four times likely to inflict burn on enemies with a reduced art attack. Casting arts according to enemy weaknesses has benefits beyond purely damage dealt. Nice. Okay, so let's go in here. Max on the waistcoat. So let's give you the natural waistcoat. Okay, max on the crown. Here's the amber circlet with the rangu sealed. Okay, you're now maxed on everything. Uh, yeah, we'll just take that. Um, hmm. Yeah, well, uh, 
nothing we can do there, unfortunately. Void ring, there we go. Command. Here, take it for boots. See, I can't remember if it was you can get the library system plus skills. Two more basic. Output of night win plus skills efficiency class skill groups. Um, nah, damn, I wanted the. Wanted the one to one for lock skills to see how they work. Cause I thought maybe I thought it was once you get up to. Damn it! Focus, guys! Right in the Tiger blade! complete nice uh, let's go this way because we can well, actually we came in that way so yeah let's take out this top loop first of all move towards the dead end see what's there and then move out of it Okay, we need some kind of interacting power. Good. To surely this is good. Spread out. Kick out of water. Resilient. Charge in there. Break down. All right. Concentrate your attack. Very well. Not my chance. All right. Well done. Spin and strike. Earth Dragon Bay. This is an over. Fancy around you. Water. I will smite evil. Spin and strike. Like literally. Change to change to fire for yeah, change to fire for good reason. Why'd you change back, you bastards? Hanging hair left. Yeah. <laughs> uh, went out of this way just for attachment. Come on. I wonder at what point they're gonna give me whatever thing needed to break these rocks. Because it's probably never going to be early enough. Because giving me a whole bunch of areas that's like, hey, this exists, kind of really sucks. Because <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, I go, like, unless I am forced to go back here, I'm never coming back here. So I'm never going to break these rocks. Emergency. Yeah, cause I'm not I'd like. I don't see why I would ever have to come back to this very specific mini dungeon, basically, um, for any for any reason, frankly. Um, so it's like, okay, if you don't have the rock break power, 
I'm not really. There you go. Version say did a whole Looks bunch like there's of something stuff. nearby. Found a new discovery point. Husk of an ancient structure. Gone pretty good when I feel the controller vibrate to just immediately hit X to find whatever vibrated. Hmm. This forest was a ruin too. We haven't found a ruin yet that wasn't crawling with hellions. The malevolence really is widespread. I'm sorry. Huh. It tears me up inside seeing all these ruins defiled. But if we purify the Hellions while we explore the ruins, isn't that like two birds with one stone? Think about how jealous of our adventures literally every other historian and archaeologist will be. You're such a sweet, simple soul. You know that? <laughs> huh? You're right. Running over this won't get us any such closer a sweet, to our soul. <laughs> we should all take a page out of Miklio's book and laugh at our worries. And if Saray thinks you're happy-go-lucky, I think Miklio's in shock. Let's get going, touchy-feely Miklio. Hey, you're doing this on purpose. Or for short, touchy Felio. No, no nicknames. Stop it. Stop nicknaming me. I refuse. Miklio is too easy to nickname off of. Elixir currently held. Yo, fully restores one allies HP and SC, restores three BJ, uh, BJ, BJ, and BG, and heals KM. Could this be Elixir? Oh, wow. An all healing panacea made by Mount Hellas? Butterfly. Whoops! I guess it's random o'clock again. <laughs> For whatever you can't talk about that. You think it's the real thing? According to the celestial record, the methods used to make elixir were lost ages ago. So hold us until the last fight of the game. Guess we won't know for sure unless we try it. You think that's safe? It'll yes. just be a drop. Whoa! I feel rejuvenated. It is the real thing. Nice. Wish we could just buy this at the store. That'll be difficult. The only remaining elixir left in the world of humans is in custody of the church. The church, huh? The church. Ran out of bugs, I take it. <laughs> the church. Well, I happen to be the shepherd. Okay. Usual. Of course, because we're here. If we weren't here, we wouldn't have won. But we were here, and therefore we did. We're all very strong. <laughs> but I am getting a lot more used to this game's combat system. So, while I'm not going to be dodging every attack, I, I, I am capable of at least getting some of them, I feel. Uh, bamboo stack. Uh, Lila, okay, you're still working on that, but bamboo stack, pretty big increase, which is nice. Hey. Okay. on you, Lila. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Do some fortune telling. Please pick one. Cast okay. tiara. Oh, this one's blank. That means your spirit is pure. <laughs> that means your spirit is pure. But yeah, the after after combat ones and how it's not always the same with the, like the partner because like tales are similar to trails in that way where it's like oh after combat they have a little something to say, um, or at least cold steel onward. But um, I do I like how it's unique. Back. After each one, it's like a random chance of different ones happening. Whereas in Trails, it's kind of like, oh, whoever the pair is, is it's their pair conversation. Okay. 
understand the social hierarchy of humans. Mm, neither do I. Social hierarchy is weird. Ah, but Joe, nice. I just this. saw a monolith written in ancient tongue. Appears to be wisdom pertaining to the powers written in an ancient tongue. Great. Earn enough grain, you'll increase the lore of the land's blessing level for that area. Each time the blessing level of an area goes up, new boons affecting that area become available to be configured at save points. Blessing level also affects the maximum boon cost total. Uh, so if boons you want, start stockpiling that grain. Start stockpiling that shit, bitch. Art, tiles proficiency increased. Okay. Oop. Battle boots. Uh, here, take those. Uh, yeah, nothing that you weren't already on. Okay. Rav trigger. Uh, oop. And battle boot. Um, amber boots. Let's get you on calcite boots. And you learned a new art. Rending gale, hidden iron, which uses a ferocious charge, spinning slash, and unleashes a devastating lightning attack on the area a moment later. Interesting. Yeah, this is one aspect where, in terms of. I don't want to say weakness of the game, but the way that they have, like, the control scheme makes it so... Uh, uh, how, do, how do I say? Um, in Symphonia, it felt like I had a better understanding, and Vesperia, of, like, of the arts that I was using, and being able to be like, okay, I want to use this one, I want to use this one, I want to use this one, have knowledge of what I'm doing, but... That was also aided by the fact that, like, um, uh, that it worked in a slightly different way, where it was like, hey, here's this button that puts this skill out there. Here's this one, whereas this one's kind of like, hey, A, but also A in a left direction, but left direction is your move stick as well, so it's also kind of like weird to aim them sometimes okay there we go purification complete Learn new art cast umbrella times two nice uh, new wisdom, weakness, and resistance. There are various types of resistances displayed in blue when dealing damage to a resistant enemy. Resist. Enemy damage will be halved. Enemy will defend more easily. Restrain. Damage can be inflicted, but the enemy cannot be staggered. Ineffective. Damage is reduced by 90%. Reflect. Damage is reflected back at you. Well, at least there. Okay, so so hopefully I'll get a little bit better at learning my Is it over? Uh, skills, but it's a little difficult. Okay, got plenty of AP though. Thorny vest. Okay, yeah, we're getting close with several people. Yeah, and that's fine though. 
Premium. Okay, so hopefully I'll be able to go back there because this is the first time where it's like a dead end that I just need to be able to break something before I can actually access what it's holding back from me. Yeah, and there's another, so I would hope that maybe after this they just give it to me. Uh, set Normans. Okay, you can, I guess, only set one Norman per. Um, elixir 27 grade. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, there aren't that many usable items so far, unless I just haven't bought them. Uh, and I have a lot of AP that I would like to have equipped, but... Uh, one time when taking fatal damage, I'm not going to release armonization. However, Seraph character will be KO'd. Ooh. Um, character change with X and that. Switch control character as follows. Left side. Second problem. Yeah. Wouldn't be bad if I knew how to play the different characters, but I don't. Nor do I really care to. <laughs> I really like playing as the one character. They always make the the main character pretty darn fun as well. Like they they don't mess with that. Um and attack was right. however acquired grade is halved. Hmm. Let's say we're attack with projectile. Well, hmm. If I'm you know what? Attack vertical horizontal project. I mean, you know what? I don't need grade to be... See, the question is, is this grade just in general? Or is this... Or is this specifically grade from the bonus of doing the thing? I mean, I'm going to try it here just to test it out. But I am curious. Um, you know, I'm going to gonna hold off on doing anything with food right there okay so let's go in here because if I do have that equipped I am curious to see um, right because one it'll help make battles go faster easier but also if it can help with the quick evades does it just auto do it or does it quick evade because it's like hey well when attacked with a horizontal strike so i don't know if it means when it lands or if it does it at the right time to quick evade because if it can quick evade for me then that'd be pretty awesome it would make it a lot easier to get that number up faster Ready? Yes. Yes. Let's fight the plant man. Okay. Hello there, sir. Okay. You are resistant to fire and water. Weak. Yeah, very weak to physical. So... The area? No, it looks like a mutant hellion, like Ouroboros. Mutant hellion? It's probably the effect of the anomalous orbs. Just like the ones Knight Arthur and Echidna had. Let's keep our guard up. Can you life bottle your friend? Okay, well, I you did not need to be. Concentrate your attack. 
Okay, well, mm -hmm. we try. Uh, bad action didn't seem to help. Maybe because I wasn't finding a good one. Um, yeah, you're... Yeah, you like... Okay, and this time, what I won't do is I'm not going to. Uh, this time, I'm not going to uh, merge. Okay, could you life bottle? Er. Okay, really? You immediately go. Okay, so you're just programmed to go for the caster. You're actually the most annoying piece of shit ever. Okay. Okay, let's try again. Um, let's go into arts. Just turn off those so you're more forced to just physically attack because you're not helping by casting. Yeah. And let's. Focus your efforts. Is this like the plant boss of the area? No, it looks like a mutant hellion, like Ouroboros. Mutant hellion? It's probably the effect of the anomalous orbs. Just like the ones Knight Arthur and Echidna had. Let's keep our guard up. Let's keep it up. Okay. Your HP. Good. Also, apple gel. Okay, you are sitting pretty. Stop fucking casting. I literally turned off everything but one of your casts, and you are casting. There we go, you dumb bitch. There we go. Jesus. Oh, Lord. Okay. Stun, boosted abilities, one against powerful foe, defeated foe, which up banish blast. Oh, okay. Interesting. So coming out. Unless one of them did a banish blast. Which I don't think they did. When it comes out, it's doing a banish blast. Power links. With any given enemy group, there may be a number of low ranked enemies, but never let your guard know. So enemies can form power links with each other, normally inflating their power and watching, making them immune to status ailments. Watch out for enemies that flash red. Feel linked enemy to sever and disable the power link. Hmm. Interesting. That was fucking obnoxious. Bang, we did it. Just had to turn off casting. Now the blessing should return to Marlin. Oh no! Oh. You're Alicia. Are you getting a like, blind in your right eye? Eat this. Like what's going on, dude? He 
you couldn't see it, could you? So the Squire's Pact is affecting you. No, I just wasn't paying attention. Alicia and Nicleo nearly died because of you. Okay, well, don't say because of you. Just, we were all... I'm not dead, and Saray was only hiding it for Alicia's sake. I understand that, but even so... He's at his limit. I know. Saray? Alicia! Thank goodness. So what is this Squire's Pact? Don't worry about me. It looks like we were able to explore Rohan's domain. Well, that's that. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I do want to check in on Lucas's crew. Here. Thanks. Okay, not gonna explain the Squire's Pact. That was a tough enemy. Let's prepare for our next battle. Just gonna leave it at what it was. Okay, cool. This is just oh man, the Squire's Pact must be taking a big effect on you. Okay, let's not explain why. Please. Also, you did not give me the hey you can break shit stuff. Okay, well great. Bro. Um also I should go through Oh, come on. Arts again, so I can turn all the casts back on. Cloudy Swirl? It's Splash. <laughs> yeah, I haven't even used it once. Higher Seraphic Art of Ice Reaver. Ah, okay. Hmm. Okay, actually. Let's come in here, 22. Good. So if I do this, save point travel, can I just go back to one, two, and price 603? That's bullshit. I mean, I got money, but I mean, like, that's an entire piece of equipment. Come on. Can't be cool. Luckily, it's not too far. And everything's already been killed, so it's an easy walk out. And I got an anomalous orb again. So when you vest anomalous orb, boost everyone's max HP. So that's, yeah, it's just a key item that every time I get it, everyone's max HP goes up more. Okay. That's, a, that's an acceptable... That's an acceptable way to do it. Okay, Calcite Sword. You are now maxed. Wish you weren't, but hey. Amber Earrings. Flame Black Earrings. Fire damage have reduced by... Um, yeah, let's do that, because I can just fuse the Amber Earrings. Um, firing here. Take that, and then Battle Boots plus three. Battle boots. Um, yeah, I'll keep them on because we're going to the town anyway, so I'll be able to fuse the battle boots again. Yeah, those are working. Earth ring. Here, take that earth ring. Amber boots. Amber spear. Yeah, shabby, which is actually really good for. Calcite ribbon. Here we go. Firing. Here, take that earth ring. Amber boots. Uh, sure, take this calcite. Silky touch garment. Yeah. Okay. We're working. Yum. Really use some more of them 
run speed increasing items instead of just anomalous orb. Make me zoom across the world. See, that's one of those funny things where it's like, I'm willing to bet that in like, um, if you used like a save file or like a hex hex hexadecimal editor or something or so, some whatever, um, be able to like give yourself more items than, uh, do not mean to. God damn it. Come on. I want to get my vanish blasts in. God, it takes forever. armor like that heavy? No. This is what protects both myself and the entire nation. Doesn't mean it's not heavy. The heavy thing is this conversation. It can be, it can be, it can be heavy, even if it's that, like that. It's here. Oop. Oh, hello there. Alright, equipment with open skills. I can make it nice and pretty speary. Focus. Okay, yeah. Um, cherished umbrella. Number of combos, bamboo stack. Let's, I guess, put it on... one that's going to be used so yeah let's put it on that one that's what picks it good need more talk to the lord lamp wonder if there's a um wonder there has to be an achievement for getting all the all of them all the things all the dormans it's like i couldn't imagine in this game not having something like that. <laughs> Random collectible thing? You can put an achievement on that? Yeah, please. There go. Gotta get that BG up. And get that moderate combat. Or moderate. God damn it. Sound of a bitch. Stop. And you guys. Baby. Yeah, there we go. Art Level up. New art, new art, earth ring, tile proficiency, tile proficiency, AP. Good. Remedy preparation apple gel. Please make more of those. Please make a whole bunch more of those because it's starting to get to the point where it's like, okay, yeah, no, I am going to be using those in combat a little bit more frequently than I have been the entire rest of the game. So. I would like it if, um... Let's do that. Good. And hopefully, by the end of this, I'll have had enough, um, combat to get Grayed, uh, up in the area again, so I can see what the next things are okay now we can go to Mono city yeah so i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to get a little bit farther like progress the main storage a little bit more and then i'm going to uh probably call it a night because i got another stream this weekend so we can we can take it a little bit slow but yeah i don't know if it'll be tomorrow on saturday or the following day on Sunday just yet 
Just have to figure that out. Hello. Hey, Shepherd's pie. As you can see, Shepherd's pie. Thanks. I knew you could handle it. How'd it go? We managed. Good to hear it. And I guess it's time for us to pack up and ship on out. Yeah, indeed. The guards are trickling back onto duty, and we've got a new job lined up already. Oh yeah. Who and what? Shall we take a break at the end for a spell? Sure. <laughs> What'd you say, Sonny? Sure, we'll bump into each other, one another somewhere someday. Uh, if it's as enemies on the battlefield, though, rest assured I won't hold back. <laughs> uh, let's hope not, because then you'll die. Because I will kill you. I will moitherize you, you son of a bitch. Um, actually, yeah, this is where Weapon Man is. Okay, Fuse. Let's go Shabby Spear. This one ain't done yet, so I'm going to hold it, because that, you get, like... It gives a little bit more time. Um, I will fuse this one because you're already you're already a good portion of the way through. Um, we got several of these at this point, so heart attack, heart attack, heart attack. Um. Yeah, let's do that one first. Give her a real good art attack. Okay, and then amber earrings with these. Sure. So I have another to have, but at least it's good. Um, calcite circlet can go, but I haven't even boosted either of them. Calcite tiara. Let's do that. Good. And then calcite hairband already working. So let's do that. Natural waistcoat plus that. Let's go up to plus three. Calcite waistcoat, you're almost maxed. So let's give you that. Thorny vest hasn't been touched. Void ring. Void ring plus seven. Um, the firing, let's do that, get the max out of there, earth ring, with another earth ring max, refuse that, and then it keeps it open for other people to take a look-see, earth ring plus one max, can do this to get to a plus two, Um, yeah, yeah, do that. That way, it's at least I'm equipped on someone, not just sitting there, not having been uh, worked. You're gonna have to get a new one anyway, so might as well fuse it to you. And as a void thing, for, yeah, good. Okay, because she's gonna need to get a different ring anyway. Battle boots, I can. But them into these, and then his battle boots can go into these. Good. Battle boots plus five. Amber boots. Amber boots can go into those for a plus four, which is fine because they're still equipped. And then your amber boots can go with these for a plus one, which is fine. Command shoes, nothing. Okay, good. Buy goods. Um, rod of turmoil. It's at least something. No shabby spear. Um, yeah, you find calcite, raw spice. Yeah, let's make let's buy that. I don't think I meant to equip it, but let's let's buy some calcite earrings. Going to invest midi blouse. Let's buy that. Not gonna equip it just yet. Wind ring. Yeah, just more. Drop 
Uh, Brank is now patron. Cool. And Holy Bottle. Once you use no weak foes will be encountered until the next stay on in or the next time you escape from... Ooh, that's actually really nice. <laughs> they really boosted how good a... They really boosted how good uh, Holy Bottles are. Um, because before it was like, oh, it's like kind of like a rappel, but it's not perfectly like a rappel. But like this is like, hey, this go it goes until you either stand in or the next time you escape from battle. So I don't know what weak foes means, but like the, the fact that the length of time that it's effective is so much more increased potentially is actually really nice. Um, okay, and let's go back to here. Calcite sword. Yeah, there's no additional swords, but you did have these. Okay. Amber garments. Midi blouse. Okay, so you can at least get that. Calcite garment. Yeah, unfortunately, there ain't much more. Doggy dog. Yeah, I took off your ring. Um,. Here, work on yeah, work on windring. That's fine. And Amber Staff. Uh that's Amber Staff plus one. Calcite. Um Ancient. Not really worth it, I would say. So let's go with that. Because that's fine. And everyone's title proficiency is looking good. Head on over here. Up into here. And out and around. Bada bing, bada boom. Speak. Um, uh, yeah. No, we'll just go for that. Oh, and eating it counts as a stay at the end. <laughs> Forgot about that. And tomorrow, we'll be leaving Marland? Yeah, that's the idea. We got other places to go and save. Why? Oh, hello there. What? You just went through that window. Why? Huh? Why what? Gotta be a bit more specific. Hello, friendo. Sarah? So you are with this one. Why aren't you staying in Marland? Oh, okay. What is your problem? Silas Brass. I'm asking the shepherd. Why are you throwing away the name you've earned for yourself from saving this town? Why throw yourself away like this? Throw yourself away? Trying to save the world, bro. We've done all we can here. And I have more to learn elsewhere. That's all. How odd. You too. <laughs> it's like, yeah, we don't need to be here. Like, I don't know. We have a quest. But this we don't need to be there famous. Are other humans who dwell with Seraphim besides me. So yay. Kill the assassins. Yeah. No one's perfect. Well, I say to hell with them. The more important issue is where we're headed next. Thought about it? I have. The Roland's Empire. Yo. Splendid idea. Hellions and ruins alike know no borders after all. True. <laughs> I'm gonna have a bit of an issue getting her into uh, the country, aren't I? Eat pork and potatoes. Okay, so the woodsman. So that was Lucas and the woodsman, huh? We sure are a funny bunch. It seems people form bonds in more ways than I realized. Their logic makes sense, though, if you buy their premises in the first place. Those who give themselves completely to what they believe in are all the more pure for doing so. It's true that I felt no malevolence from them. You mean, malevolence doesn't spring merely from the distinction between right and wrong? 
Even a villain might not bear any malevolence, specifically because they believe so thoroughly in their villainy. Okay. Yeah, man. So it's more about thinking you're doing something wrong well, versus sure actually doing something wrong. Being you're so concerned about it. I think it's good too, Sarai. Though it's a fine line between pure and naive. Can't argue with you there. Ah, this is making my brain hurt. So you can be heinous, but if you don't believe you're heinous, then you're fine. <laughs> we sure have had some fantastic weather lately. On that note, it's time to continue our skill lecture. If you say so. <laughs> Today's lesson is about bonus skills. Aren't you ecstatic? Uh, sure. Yeah, please. You can probably enact a couple skills without even thinking too much about it. But from the combination of basic skills you use comes... Wait for it. <laughs> bonus skills. But hullabaloo aside, the way it works is actually super simple. There are only three special rules. There's stat, a bonus that activates when you equip the same skill multiple times. Lumping them together like that will give you a little extra boost. The effectiveness will vary based on how many of the mm -hmm. same skill you stack. But at the end of the day, it produces only one stack bonus. Okay, yeah, so we knew that. So when you equip four of the same skills, the stack for the second or the third ones don't occur. Next, when you equip all five skills belonging to the same group, you have a group union. For this one... You'll need to have collected all five skills of a specific column. The bonus skill will further enhance those skills' effects. And lastly, there are elemental unions, which trigger when you place skills of the same element next to each other. But, oops, out of time. See you again next week. Seriously? <laughs> no, that one's a cliffhanger. <laughs> uh, okay. So, let's go into there. Save as successful. And... Let us, uh, oh, okay. Let's return to the title because uh, this is where I'm going to end the stream. So, with that, thank you very much for dropping by, Fontano, Sleeper, and uh, anyone else that dropped by and was lurking. Uh, I will be back either tomorrow or Sunday with some more Tales of Zestiria. But uh, until then, I hope you all have a very nice night, and will uh, join me then. Bye.